Hey everyone, this is Color Hill Benz from Destination Thrills, and I am here with the final construction update that we will have before August 13th's big announcement from Silver Dollar City. It has been a long and amazing journey creating these construction updates for you as we try to uncover what Silver Dollar City is building in 2020. Now, to get some perspective, this is the footage that we took back in March when we did our first construction update. As you can see, not much was happening at the time. All the land clearing was starting to wrap up and they had begun to put in concrete walls to make up the trough for the new attraction. Now since then, much has taken place. As you can see, more concrete walls and troughs have been built and you can even start to see some theming elements showing up around the site and even some trees and some bushes that have been planted along the layout. So we'll get into this layout in just a second, but I also wanted to show you that since our last update, the building for the new rib house has been erected and a lot of work has been done. Uh, this is kind of toward the front of the construction area, so it's actually blocking a lot of the footage that we were able to get the last time we were here. So it was kind of interesting trying to film around this and kind of losing the angles that we had a couple months ago. But it was really cool to see this rib house getting constructed, and we are hearing it's going to be absolutely fantastic. Now, as we shift over, we are starting to notice that the layout for this ride is starting to take the shape of the old Lost River of the Ozarks. We are hearing that it won't follow the exact layout of the old Lost River of the Ozarks, but that it will follow along a similar path. So if you think about the old layout, it started up near the barn swing area, and as you can see right now in this footage, this is where the lift hill would be to take you to the beginning of the ride. Then it would kind of go along the midway that takes you to barn swing and takes you to the front area by the rib house, which is what you're seeing here. Now in this clip, this is where I believe the station is being built. As you can see, they've done a lot of concrete and woodwork around the area. And this is sort of where the entrance was for the old Lost River of the Ozarks. If this isn't the entrance, this is likely the underground or indoor area of the ride that I think they're going to have themed to the Marvel Cave. Here is another view of that structure coming from the barn swing area. Um, as you can see looking down, there are several troughs and a gigantic concrete structure. Again, this would either resemble the indoor portion of the ride or the station. Finally, I wanted to show you what is happening near the fireman's landing area of this construction site. It appears that they're building some sort of plaza in this area and it's starting to look really nice. There are several trees in the area and it is shaping up to be an area that you'll have a fantastic view of the pond over there by fireman's landing. This will probably be toward the entrance of the ride is what I'm thinking but it's too early to speculate where this is gonna fit in with the new 2020 attraction. So this is the final construction update that we will have before the announcement. We will continue to have construction updates after the announcement as I will be making several more trips in 2019. Also be on the lookout for our 2020 and beyond prediction video for Silver Dollar City. You're not gonna to wanna to miss it. We are not only gonna talk about what I think is happening for 2020, which we almost seem to have confirmed already through the construction video, but also a look into the future of Silver Dollar City, which appears to be very bright. So leave your thoughts on the 2020 construction in the comments section below, and leave us your speculation and ideas. And as always, if you like this video, give it a like, and subscribe to Destination Thrills, the destination for all the latest theme park news and content. I'm Color Hill Benz, have a good one.